Hey folks, this is Phil from Angler Sport Fishing. Today we're going to be looking at the Munts Angling Castable Convertible Flies. These baits are truly works of art. They're beautiful baits. Uh, Andrew Munts, who I met at the Wisconsin Muskie Expo in Wausau, ties these each by hand. They are just absolutely beautiful baits. This one I've thrown for a couple years and it's actually been in a muskie or two's mouth. Um, but we're going to be talking about them. Obviously fly fishing has just become incredibly popular i mean in the last probably few years it's really starting to blow up um obviously chris willen and some of his guys like that have been doing that for years uh, chris was really um pioneering and making the rods for g loomis for cat uh for fly casting for muskies and then um the guys at musky fool rowan stam shout out my dude rowan um they did an episode with mike keys they've been doing a lot to really make it more popular uh going fly fishing for muskies but the nice thing with these baits is that you're not throwing these with a fly rod. These are made for bait casting reels. These can you use on a regular setup. I'm gonna be using them on one of my regular casting rods. Um, and like I said, they're just beautiful works of art. But I'll give you Andrew's info here. So it's months angling. Here's his phone number. I'll have all his info tagged in, uh, in the comments as well or in the description. And uh, yep, months angling is the brand. Let's check them out. So before we throw some baits here, I got to show you what these things really have going on. So these baits um, are able to be made weedless. It's hard to see through all this stuff, but he's got wires here. And you can put those wires right down. Oh, come on. He's got, you can put those wires right down on there. And they're going to keep those bait, the weeds off your hook. You can use those right through the weeds. Or you can put them out and they kind of keep stuff off as well if you leave them out. Um, just kind of keep floating grass and other crap off of there, which is a godsend on Green Bay as well. So um, the, the really neat thing with these is that they hang. You can cast these out, and he's got a whole system. I mean, if you get in contact with Andrew, he's got an incredible system. You can add weights. You can add floating things to them. Um, just as, as is right here, this bait, you can throw it out and let it hang, and it sinks really slow. And, you know, there's rubber baits that hang, and there's, like, jerk baits, wooden baits. But the thing with this is that even as it's sitting there, all that hair, and I should say feathers, and everything, the hair that's in here, just keeps moving. So imagine if you throw this, you know a muskie is sitting under a dock or something, you throw this, and as it sinks, it sinks ever so slowly, and it just keeps moving as it's going down. It's almost like it's breathing or pulsing. Um, Jeremiah Wolf, another guy that I met at the Wausau Muskie Expo, throws these in rivers. He goes nuts over these things. He's the one who actually talked me into buying one in the first place, and I'm very happy that he did, so... We'll take a look at them. We'll give them a couple casts and show you the baits. All right. All right, let's take a look at the month's cast will fly here in the water. So you really can't work this the wrong way. I kind of like to do a little uh, stop and go kind of a thing here. It really gets the, almost the same way as I work a beaver with the, just the reel doing the action. You can see all that fur and hackle really gets going. It's probably not fur, it's hair, but. You know, I'm not a fly guy. As all the fly guys refer to us as, I'm a gear guy. And they say it like that. Oh, you're a gear guy. Ugh. <laughs> but you can almost do like short taps, like a jerk bait. Even if you just leave it sit. You can just tell how that thing kind of just keeps moving. Give another cast here. And there you go. That's the Munts Castable Convertible Fly. Check them out. Just a quick addendum here. Uh, the reason they call them the Convertible Flies is that he's got all sorts of different accessories you can add to it. Got like a prop bait here to make it as a top water or a different style here as well as bucktail blades or you could add weights to them as well. He's got something that wraps around um, that turns a regular convertible casting fly into a floating 
fly or keeps it up higher so it doesn't doesn't sink um, he's got an incredible amount of engineering going into these i'm really not doing it the full service but if you get in contact with andrew he can give you the whole spiel he does a great job with presenting what he's got but um definitely awesome baits worth checking out and uh check out the episode of keys with uh, musky fool as well he's uh mike's throwing them in the video all right folks thanks for watching the video on the months castable convertible fly i got a floating one here i kept this one dry just so you could see how cool they still look but um as i'm doing in all my videos this year i'm doing a shameless plug um we're going to be hosting a musky tournament on green bay october 7th um it's going to be a, a fishing tournament from seven to two you can troll or cast whichever you prefer all the uh all the rules and all the info is on the fish donkey app as well as on facebook it's going to be called the three more lines adoption fundraiser musky tournament um, basically my wife and i are adopting a child and it's a very expensive process so uh, we're accepting donations we're going to be doing silent auctions raffles everything after that and um, if you have any questions on it if you're interested in fishing if you're interested in donating reach out uh, i'll be happy to answer any questions for you and hopefully we see you all there thanks for watching